And a good Thursday to you. I'm meteorologist Cindy Fitzgibbon. A little bit of cloud cover passing on through early this morning, but those clouds are dissipating as high pressure builds on in. So we're going to have the sunshine today, but this is cold high pressure out of Canada. So it is going to be a cold day blustery too, as those winds kick up out of the northwest sustained 12 to 20 and they will be gusting higher. So temperatures are going to struggle. I think 20 is the best we do in most areas, maybe briefly touching 30 degrees parts of the South Shore and the Cape average high this time of year though is 36 and we've been in the 40s even touching 50 earlier this week so it is going to be a cold one for you today and despite temperatures being in the 20s with the wind blowing wind chills get no higher than the teens throughout the day so bundle up if you're headed outside the winds do settle back down tonight and with mainly clear skies it's going to be even colder tonight than it was early this morning. Look at the low temperatures out the door tomorrow morning. Single digits and teens. Less wind though, so wind chills not as brutal as you're stepping outside tomorrow morning. We actually recover in the afternoon tomorrow. We'll have sunshine, lighter winds. We sneak up over the freezing mark, maybe touching the mid 30s and a few spots north and west of town. So not as bad tomorrow as high pressure starts to slide eastward. Winds turn to the southwest Friday night into Saturday, and that is going to bring in some milder temperatures. So we will warm it up, but the clouds will be increasing. You can see rain off to our west on Saturday. So Saturday is a dry day with the increasing clouds. We'll get very close to 50 degrees here coming up on Saturday. And then we've got the rain coming in. I think we're going to wake up to some showers here on Sunday morning. And as this front drops southward, the rain will tend to taper off by Sunday night, but then colder air is going to start to work on in. And with the system lingering offshore, what's called an inverted trough could set up. And basically that may focus a little bit of moisture back along the coastline. And that could linger into Tuesday with colder air in place. Snow showers will be possible Monday on into Tuesday. So we're going to be watching it. It doesn't look like significant amounts of moisture and big accumulation, but something we'll be watching early next week. So 50 on Saturday, still in the 40s on Sunday and then behind that front. Yep, it's cooling down once again. Highs only in the 20s to around the freezing mark by the middle of next week.